Hey guys, for this video, I'm going to show you how to make audio ID public in Roblox. So first, you want to open Roblox in your browser, and you want to make sure that you have logged in into your account. Then, over here at the top left, you want to click on Create. Then, you want to click on Creations over here at the left. Then, you want to click on Development Items. Then from the set of options over here at the top, you want to click on audio. Then you're going to click on upload asset. So you're going to create your asset here. So first you want to create a name for your asset and you can also add a description if you want. So I'm just going to name this audio. Then you're going to upload your asset over here by clicking on the upload button. And you want to take note that your audio should be under 6 seconds or else you won't be able to make it public. And after that, you want to scroll down and click on upload. And after you've done that, over here at the bottom, you'll be able to see the asset that we have uploaded. So we're going to click on it. Then you want to scroll down to the bottom where you'll be able to see distribution. Then you're just going to click on distribute on creator store. But in order for you to make this public, you have to first enroll at the asset privacy. So just click on enroll. And once you're here, you're going to turn on the asset privacy. And after that, we can go back to creations. Then development items and audio. Then we're going to click on our audio again. Now we're going to scroll down and as you can see, we can now submit a request for the approval to distribute. So we're going to click on submit for review so that we'll be able to click on the distribute on creator store and make this audio public. So to take note that your Roblox account should also be verified in order for you to proceed. So if you're not yet verified, just click on verify over here. And after that, you're going to click on all of these options. Then you're going to click on submit. So after you have submitted for the approval to distribute, your request should be under pending, which typically takes around 24 hours. But usually, it will be approved instantly. So after you have submitted for review, you're just going to go back to this page where you'll be able to see that you have been approved already. So after you have been approved, just toggle on this button, then click on save changes. So I hope this helps and thanks for watching.